The government and development partners have agreed on the coordination mechanisms and framework they believe can help accelerate development through the participation of all sectors. This was the outcome of the roundtable implementation meeting held in Vientiane Province's capital last week. After the meeting ended last Friday, Minister of Planning and Investment Dr. Supankeo Misai, the province's governor Mr. Vidong Sayeson, and United Nations Coordinator and United Nations Development Program Representative Ms. Karina Imonin joined a press conference to inform the media about the outcomes. Dr. Supan said, we have agreed with the majority of the recommendations on various topics raised by development partners at the meeting, while also providing explanation to their queries. Our PDR has uh, all the potential and, and... The meeting approved the progress made in implementation work for 2015-2016 and the target plan for 2017 aiming to attract broadened and quality investment and expanding the diverse economic basis that can help ensure macroeconomic stability. A competitiveness within the region. To ensure these, they have agreed on ensuring compliance between the economic plan and the budget to drive transparency while improving broadened dialogue mechanisms on development and service access for all. The integration for indicators of the Sustainable Development Goals or SDGs into the framework of each sector at the central and local levels, with the participation of all sectors in their implementation, has been noted for its cooperation, capacity building for supporting food and nutrition security, and other vulnerabilities, including the program on reducing the impacts of UXO. <laughs> Based on the progress made in the implementation of food and nutrition security, the government and development partners agreed on the need for more capacity building, better coordination mechanisms as well as enhancing the ownership of local authorities to include the National Food and Nutrition Program into their local plans. Importance has also been given to good partnerships to attract all sectors to participate in implementing the program realizing the creation of models on food and nutrition security and their expansion to provinces throughout the country. For green growth as well as climate change and disaster response preparedness, attention will be paid to acknowledge the implementation plan on balancing green and sustainable growth. To sustain uh, the management of this forest. It was agreed that the Ministry of Planning and Investment would serve as the principal coordinator between the concerned ministries, including the Ministry of Natural Resources and Environment and the Ministry of Agriculture and Forestry. All sectors, especially the private sector, will be encouraged to develop clean sustainable production bases and clean and environmentally friendly production. The dissemination of the Paris Agreement on Climate Change and its inclusion into local plans so that all sectors access and participate in its implementation will be made in the agenda of cooperation, alongside capacity building for response to natural disasters, as well as good coordination at the central, provincial, district and village levels. Uh, half a million uh, beneficiaries in the villages. Community action plan. The translation of the Vientiane Declaration Country Action Plan for 2016-2025 into practice as well as capacity building for the Secretariat to the Declaration will provide a focal point in monitoring and inspection and reporting the outcomes from time to time following the roundtable meeting mechanism. Improvements of the participation mechanisms to monitor cooperation with the participation of all sectors, the improvement of regulations related to the cooperation, the creation of an effective monitoring framework of the action plan and SDGs, in compliance with national statistics systems, were also approved as part of the agenda of cooperation. Thank you.